Hey everybody, Disney Crazy Family here. Hiya. It's been a while since we've filmed and uh, we're running a little behind on pin mail. So today we have a ton of packages for you, some from uh, fellow YouTubers out there. We are super excited to uh, get into this. Pin trades. Yeah, pin trades, pin purchases. Um, pin and pop. Yeah, pin and pop. Ooh, plus the pin and pop uh, trade package has a extra special surprise and we'll get to that later we have some box lunch we have some d23 and some dmi okay so, so let's, get, let's started. get going okay first pin up is the hunchback of notre dame 25th anniversary limited edition 1750 d23 exclusive that's a lot to say <laughs> this is actually a pretty big pin it's like two by two inches um seth Help us out here. Do you know his name? <laughs> because all we know is he's like the head of um, the carnival. Yeah, the master of ceremonies ish. Is there and like uh, a? Does he have a special name? Yeah. Let us know. We'd love to know. We enjoy the knowledge. Yeah. Anyway, this one's pretty cool. I like this one. It's our second Hunchback of Notre Dame pin ever, and it's cool. It's yep. cool. Okay, second. And we're on to DMI, which is from the Black Widow. These are all the chibi heads from that movie that just recently came out, featured on Disney Plus. That Scarlett Johansson is not too happy about, but anyway, this um, movie is awesome. If you haven't seen it, you should support Scarlett Johansson as well as the rest of the cast and crew who made that movie. Yep. And we have down here in the bottom Red Guardian. We have the Mother. Sorry, we don't. We don't know her name. Yelena and the sister. Black, Black Widow. Widow. This movie was awesome. Lots of humor. <laughs> I think yeah. this is a limited edition set. Um, or it could just be an exclusive. We don't I think it was just an exclusive to DMI, Disney Movie Insiders. Either way, it's awesome. Black Widow's like my favorite superhero. And here's another one that you all may recognize. I'll let you open that because I have gloves on and it's going to be too tedious. Okay. For me. I'll get these ready. So like we said, this is also from uh, <clears throat> Disney Movie Insiders. And it is the completer pin to the Luca set that they had um, recently come out for the release of the movie. Machiavelli! Oh, okay. <laughs> New favorite cat. If you haven't seen this movie, please go watch it to understand how cute this is. So Machiavelli cute. is like my favorite cat for his attitude and his uh, <laughs> stealthiness. Yeah, he's just so cute. <laughs> this one is actually pretty big. This is a lot bigger than I was expecting. It's like a two inch pin. By one inch if you include his cute little tail over there this is a two-pronged pin um which is actually pretty good and it has the luca uh film logo uh stamped on the back that's pretty awesome that's really nice it's a big big pin and i quite enjoy it this is going to be great on our pixar board Okay, and I'm going to bust in with our Disney uh, box lunch purchase, excuse me. Runaway Railway! We picked up some more of these on the website. It's it's Pluto one to hear, you can't tell. <laughs> they put the big old sticker right there, but anyway, two Plutos. So, you know, what we do with dupes. And here's Mickey. Two Mickeys. Two Mickeys. Mickey the Mouse. Yep. The man himself. Oh, and <laughs> Daisy. This one's Sassy cute. Pants Duck. Da, da, I think da. we do have a couple of full sets for trade, you know, minus the uh, the exclusive one that was only for D23 members yes. at Box Lunch. But um, yeah, I think we do have two full sets. These will be going with us, I believe, to our pin event that we're going to in Austin this weekend on the 14th. So we'll try to get some film out there. Yeah, we'll try to uh, get this video done before that event. Hopefully. Um, if not, you know what? Future us will have them available for trade. <laughs> yeah. So if you ever want to reach us, Disney Crazy Family on all of our social medias is where you can find first us. First package is from okay, uh, Claire. First package? 
who is a fellow YouTuber. And um, I will link her channel down below. This is the first time we've ever traded with her, but uh, I've seen a couple of her videos and she is super, super awesome. It says, a uh, little note, thank you so much for the trade. I hope this bow is the one you need. Huh. Look, she included a little keychain of Mimi. That's super cute. <laughs> that is cute. You might have to put that on a, a pin bag. Oh, yes. Look, I think that's so cute. She's got one of those little like skirts like a cheerleader. It's not her regular little skirt. And she's kind of got uh, little bows on her shoes. That's really cute. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it's different. Ooh. I like it. And she also sent Miko and Pocahontas. Ooh. These are actually uh, their note tabs. Cool. And uh, these are these come in like a six pack from Box Lunch. This is really cool. We could always use more note tabs. This is awesome. Ooh. And look at that. Toy Story 4 puzzle, a mini puzzle. It's five inches by seven inches completed. Look at that. 24 pieces. Oh, that'll be fun. Yeah. Just cute. I love the tin. That's really cute. I like that. Cool. Awesome. Oh. You know what? I don't recall... I think this was only supposed to be a one pin trade that we would be receiving. Hmm. Um, so I'm not quite sure what the other package is. This was included in the box. But that's a nice surprise. Okay, the pin that I actually traded for is from the Castle series. I only needed Ariel's Castle and Rapunzel's Castle. These two have been harder than uh, the Holy Grail to find, people. <laughs> uh, and we actually, I actually traded for, let's see here. Ooh, this is huge. I actually traded for the Ariel pin, the Ariel castle. This is much, much bigger than I was expecting. And it's super nice. Now I just need the Rapunzel Tower. <laughs> if anybody has that one, please please let me know. You know what? We have some really, really nice pins that uh, you might not be able to find elsewhere for trade. Just saying. We do have Loungefly. We have Limited Edition. We have Mondo pins. Some of them are retired. <laughs> so uh, Here's the one in the other box that she was not expecting. Da, da, da. Oh, how pretty. This one's really cute. Well, thank you so much. This one's a really nice pin. This is a lovely set of mini bows. And this is the first set, right? Was this it the is first the one or second the second set? This is from the second set. Yes. Okay. All right. We'll have to see if it's the one that we were missing, but uh, we'll have to double check. Awesome. Oh, very cute. Well, thank you so much. You didn't have to do that. That was really nice. Very sweet. Thank you. I'll we'll go ahead this one. This is from Annalise in Washington. Washington. Now, do you all actually say Washington or is that just for us everywhere else? Just curious how y'all say it. Washington, Washington. Okay, and uh, this one I think we actually did buy because it was like really, really inexpensive. She was having an awesome sale. And uh, it says, thank you so much for the purchase, Annalise. And her Disney Instagram is at Disney.Pincess. And we will link that down below as well as here on the screen for you. And this was a pin I needed to help me complete a uh, set. I'm still looking for, I think, two sweaters from this series, but this is from uh, an older series, I believe in 2018. Yep. And it is Snow White. Oh, how nice. This is a really cool pin set. It had a variety of characters 
and uh, Snow White was one of the ones that I was missing. She said there was a little bit of damage on here, but it's actually not that bad. I mean, uh, of course, with any pre-owned pin, there's going to be maybe some concern. Yeah, some but, love. Yeah. Uh, really, there's only like two little dots up here on the collar that you can't even see on the camera. So no big deal. This is an awesome pin. Great. It looks pretty, pretty good. Did you show the back? Nope, because I think we got another one. Oh, okay, great. Uh, this is it for that package. Okay. I have a package here. It says, thank you so much for the trade. Hope you enjoy your new pins. Thanks again, Hannah. Mm -hmm. And this comes from Rochester, Indiana. Oh, this comes with multiples. I'll let you um, handle some of those. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this was done a little while ago. Um, Hannah actually was looking for some pins that we had that were a nightmare before Christmas uh, to try to complete some sets. This was a Facebook trade on the Disney Loungefly Pin Trading Group. Um, she's actually still looking for some sets or some pins to complete those sets I helped her out with. So uh, if anybody has those, she is looking for some Nightmare Before Christmas pins. And uh, I didn't have these. These are some really cool uh, pins. Um, these are from the Nightmare Before Christmas stamp series. Our box or our hot topic which these are from, didn't have these in store, but um, I was looking everywhere for them and she had a couple of them for trade. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. This is so big, guys, and it's glittery and it's cute. Look at that. Oh, and it's ridged. I don't know if y'all can tell that. It has like an actual stamp ridge on it. This is amazing. Cool. This, this is so cool. These are massive. Oh Mine gosh. is a the mayor. Jack, I'm just an elected official. Oh. I can't make these decisions by myself. Guys, they're making more of the mayor as Funko Pops. Come on, how cool is that? Ooh. I need him. And here's the Loungefly crown backing says Nightmare Before Christmas. Nice FAC number down at the bottom. Very nice pins. Yes, on the on the sides, on the top layer of the pins, you actually have what she's talking about, the ridging. It's like, you know, when you cut fabric, those ladies out there who sew and everything, your pinking shears, you can actually feel that all the way around. But the very back of the pin is smooth. So awesome. This is Way amazing. to go, Loungefly. Ooh, and then the next one, Oogie Boogie. He costs a whopping 13 cent cents, <laughs> Mr. Unlucky. That's really nice. Cool. And uh, I think we traded four or five pins with Hannah. These originally retailed eight ninety. Four pins. Oh, and then... Uh, the, box. Okay. the last one that... Oh intrigued me because I knew that uh, it would be really awesome to help her out and get the pins that she needed was one of these Harry Potter chippy pins. Um, this is going to be a mystery for us because I can't remember which one I traded for. It feels thin. It's in my hand. Let's see. But I thought these were all really cute. What is that? Oh, oh that's hey, hey, Fox. Yeah. Phoenix. Oh, these are really cute. That is awesome. Ironically, <laughs> it's a bird. Yeah. And if you know me, <laughs> birds aren't my thing, people. But that's really cute. This I'm, is cute. I'm glad we traded for that one. Yeah, that's super very cute. Nice. You know what? I might have to go for the entire set. I have a very small, small Harry Potter pin collection. Yeah, we've been to Universal, yeah. I think, twice, maybe yes. three times. We do collect Harry Potter pins. As well as some of the other uh, franchises available yes. at Universal Studios. Perhaps we'll shoot a video of that one day. Give us a like if you want that. Subscribe. It's free. We won't cost you a dime. Okay, the next one is another YouTube pin trade from a lovely lady who we're in a box swap with. 
Where's she from? This is Pennsylvania. Oh, this Pennsylvania. is from Pennsylvania. Nice. This is from Ms. Sassy Pants. Sassy. Mm. <laughs> and this one, I have been waiting a while to get this. <laughs> oh, that's a cute card. I love that. That's awesome. I'm going to need scissors, please. Okay, scissors. There you go. Thank you. Mm -hmm. and yeah. If you haven't checked out Miss S Ms. Sassy Pants before, um, she's a very sweet lady who does a lot of uh, pin unboxings and a lot of, like, um, what are those called? Uh, monthly box subscriptions to different locations or uh, different stores. And uh, her content's awesome. You should go check her out. Yeah. And she writes in the note, Disney Crazy Family, thank you so much for pin trading with me, Ms. Sassy Pants. I'm loving this card. I'm loving this card. I honestly thought this pin would never come into our possession after I didn't trade for it the first time I saw it. And that was like mid-COVID last year. <laughs> finally, people. Finally, I have completed the... Tangled Hot Topic pin set. And the crowd goes wild. <sighs> Flynn was the last one I needed. Thank goodness she had one. I think she had like four. And I was like, yes, please. I might as well just take all of them. <laughs> uh, but thank you so much. We really appreciate the trade. I'm glad uh, I could finally complete that set. And I think I helped her out with... Um, a Toy Story set, if I'm not mistaken. I guess you'll have to go watch her channel to find out which one I uh, I traded. <laughs> it's been a while. I don't remember. Okay, and these, I believe, are your pin and pot. Woo! Okay, I promise you, I am working on that pin and pot video. I needed to open these. Or I needed to wait for this uh, package to come in before I could finish the video, which should be uploading later this week. Okay, so Pin and Pop is a uh, very lovely site that we do trading on, and I will tell you more about it in that upcoming video. And they included a frozen postcard. Ooh, that's, that's very pretty. Nice. I love all the concept art from Frozen. Yes. Frozen 1 is my favorite out of the two. And comment on the back, Disney Crazy Family. Wow, that gumball vinylmation. So amazing. Great trade. Enjoy the pins. <gasps> Spoiler alert. Jen. Spoiler alert. Jen. Oh, How cute. Pooh and Piglet. This uh, is red cute. Balloon. Okay. Okay, also in that video that will be uploaded soon, um, I do show you what we traded for or what we sent in as our traders and this will be the receiving package. Um, I'll also show you in that video close-ups of what we received. And groove it! Yay! <laughs> the groovy girl, I love it. <laughs> Let's bring that cool. back. That's cool. I love that. Groovy. That's pretty cute. Ooh, okay. One of the pins that I traded for was a... I feel like they're a limited release. They might not be. I don't know if they're still around in the park. But it is this... Are you Chip or are you Dale? I can't tell without the... Um, one of the chipmunks, guys. Help me out. I don't see the red nose, so I'm going to be safe and say it's day, uh, Chip. I don't know if Dale... Dale should always have a red nose. Yeah, I know, but in these pins, I don't know if that actually is true. Oh. Well, help me out here if you have these, <laughs> because uh, that one's really Look. cute. Look! She included <gasps> a rubber bracelet. Ooh. You know those arm, arm bracelets? Everybody would wear. My arm's skinny enough to wear it. <laughs> yes, mine is not. Oh, this is awesome. Well, I'm not taking that off ever. Look. Daisy stationary. The sassiness. Oh, <gasps> oh gosh, there's more back here. I'm going to open this up. Go ahead. Sorry. Super cute. That scared me. Sorry. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to take my gloves off and 
get after this. Okay, we have two pins here. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, uh, I think. Wow, this is like a little bitty stationary uh, mini. I think there's some writing on the back of that. Yes, it says, thank you for the trade. But let me feature this, look. That is very cute. It feels like rice paper. That's very sweet. Mm. Okay, so uh, pin number two that I traded for. This Captain Hook Hidden Mickey pin from the new Masquerade pin series. Excuse me, Hidden Disney, Hidden Mickey, Hidden Disney. <laughs> tomato, tomato with this one. <laughs> this is really cool. We are missing um, maybe two pins from the series now, maybe three. It is Hidden, Hidden Disney 5 out of 5, and y'all can't see that, but please take my word for it. <laughs> 5 out of 5. Included more stickers. Work hard and be nice. Words to live by. That's pretty cute. I enjoy that. Pin number 3 from the Fantasy Pack. Bambi, this is really cute. I would like to complete this set. They're very cute. Be happy. Look, Grogu. <laughs> Look, Sum Sum Genie. Oh, that's pretty cute. That is cute. It is big old Sum Sum head. Okay, pin number four, I think. Yeah, pin number four. Um, the Mad Hatter from the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party in 2018, I believe. 2019. This actually glows in the dark. This pin set is really nice. They're much bigger than you would expect. And I think I'm only missing Minnie and then the one that says, um, Boo, Boo to you, I think. So I'll be on the lookout for those two. There's the last of the stickers, Ooh. which is Tigger. T I double G R. Okay, hogging up some of the pins over there. Sorry. I'm having fun with the stickers. <laughs> Pin number five. Oh, this is cute. This is from a booster set from Hong Kong, I believe. Uh, yep, I was correct. Hong Kong. This is cute little mini dressed up as a, uh, a circus girl. This is pretty cute. The entire set is adorable. I would like to try to get those. Very, very cute. Okay, this is very nice. She included a stationary notebook of the pop-up notes of the princesses. Oh, wow. There's Rapunzel, Ariel, and Jasmine. We don't know where to find these. I'm so glad she sent one of these. These are so cute. These are probably from a Daiso shop. Awesome. You pop these out and the ladies stand up. It's so cute. That's really neat. We've gotten a couple um, yes. of pages from people, but never a whole book. So no, that is incredibly thank nice. Thank you. Oh, and she also included a writing utensil. Appreciate that. That's awesome. Well. Oh, I don't want to cover those up. Okay. Pin number two, four, six. <laughs> Pin number six is a limited edition of 4,000 Thanksgiving pin. Oh, okay, this one might be my favorite that we pulled so far. It has Pleakly, Mr. <laughs> Bubbles, Jumba. Where's David? I think that's David looking at the camera. Lilo, Stitch, and Nani. This is so <laughs> cool. It is neat. I think this is my favorite Stitch pin now, guys. That is so cute. This is awesome. Ohana. Oh, that turkey's a 3D element. Did you mention that? Oh, no, I didn't. That's I, so cute. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Okay, that's like really, really cool. I love this pen. This one, this pin here says Pixie Dust from Trader Julie. So, I'll let you open that. Pixie Dust? Yes, Pixie Dust from Trader Julie. Oh, that's awesome. We actually get to know who traded with us this time. <laughs> that's nice. Okay, this one is a 
jumbo pin. I don't know if they consider it a mini jumbo or what, but it is a 2011 pin when vinyl nations were a thing. If y'all don't know what vinyl nations are, they were like cute little pre Funko figures. Um, that Disney made, and they had mystery boxes, highly collectible. They made them into pins. And you could design your own. Yes. Yes, you could. At it was the D, awesome. Was it D23 Street? That was at Downtown Disney? Oh, yeah, D Disney Street. Land. Yeah, yeah, D Street. Um, this is a limited edition of 1,000. Wow. This is a huge, huge pin. That's fabulous. This is amazing. You have one this size also, right? It has all the little Mickeys all over. Yeah, it, it, the other one I have um, that's this size kind of looks like Pac-Man. Yes. Um, and it's paint. It's like Pac-Man paint drips or whatever. <laughs> that is probably one of my favorite pins that we own. Wow. It is amazing. There's like a there's a 3D element with the... Uh, um, where you, where put you put the, the money. pennies yeah. and the money. <laughs> this is so cool. It's vibrant. I think it's like four inches, three or four inches. Uh, there is nothing. Some of these older pins, sometimes they get nicked or whatever on the front. That it looks is brand new. Yeah, yeah, it looks amazing. I cannot believe um, that somebody didn't out trade me for this pin. Um, pin and Pop kind of works like an auction um, for pins, um, and I actually won a prize. They have trivia nights, or they have trivia as part of the event as well, and I won one of the questions. I had no idea what I was going to get as a prize, and this is really cool. It is the Coco mystery pin series that came out a little uh, late in the year last year of 2020. We actually do have this set complete. Um, this is really cool. I am super surprised that we got these. Awesome. And it's brand new. It hasn't been opened. There are two pins inside the box. Um, so that'll be fun to open. Um, I don't know, who knows? We might open it on this channel. We might use it as a giveaway or we might um, wait until closer to Halloween to open it. Oh yeah. yeah. Who knows? But that's amazing. Thank you so much to yes. Jen and everybody at Pin and Pop for the uh, wonderful prize and everybody at Pin and Pop who traded with us. We are super happy and uh, we love our pins. We yes. can't, we can be more thrilled. Yep. Um, I think that's it for all the pin trades yes, so far. Yes. Uh, okay, well, um, if you have any questions about Pin and Pop, um, feel free to uh, ask them down below. Um, Give us a like. Yeah. Of course, you know, they help us out. They help us know that you like what we do and it helps us bring out more content. So if there's something that you do want to see more of or something you don't want to see more of, also let us know. Subscribe. It's free. We won't charge you at all. We don't, um, we never sell. Yeah, so we don't sell pins. <laughs> yeah, we, we love the trade. We love our pin family that trades with us because if you do trade with us, you are now part of the pin family. So, and we do love meeting new people. We trade internationally. Yes, we do. Um, Thank you for coming along on this pintastic journey of ours. We'll see you later, pin family. Bye. Bye.